the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's law. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 135, Job 18 to 19. Having sincere hope, hearing the evil words of his friends who would not admit that his suffering was the suffering of a righteous person, he pleaded for them to take pity on him. First point, Bildad rebuked Job with his ever consistent words. Bildad replied and said to Job, When will you end these speeches? Be sensible, and then we can talk. We ask at this point who between Job and his friends understood this situation. Job did not understand his situation. Thus, he was asking God why this had happened to him and was trying to make his friends understand that he did not need their rebuking. Neither Bildad nor the other friends understood the situation. Bildad made Job's suffering even worse by rebuking him. Second point, the wicked person whom Bildad referred to was based on his thoughts on Job. Bildad explained that the wicked was bound to perish. Bildad's reference to the wicked was Job. He said that light will disappear for the wicked. He then said that the wicked will grow tired whilst walking. Third, he said that the wicked will get tangled in the rope so that he cannot walk back up. Fourth, he said that the wicked will be chased by fear. Fifth, he said that the wicked will face illness and eventually perish. Sixth, the wicked will be left with no place to stay. Seventh, the wicked will have no descendants. All these points Bildad was referring to was based on Job's situation. Third point, Job claimed that the one to give him suffering was God. Amidst his suffering, Job said a few things to his friends. The first was that God gave him suffering he could not escape. The second was that God had taken away his glory. The third was that God had taken away all his hope. The fourth was that God had attacked him as if he was an enemy. The fifth was that God had made all his family and friends drift away from him. Fourth point, Job asked his friends to have a compassion for him. The rebuking of his friends was even more painful for Job than his physical aching. Job no longer had the energy to argue with them. Job asked his friends who were treating him like a sinner for their confession. Fifth point, now Job's only hope was God. Job's friends did not listen to Job's request for compassion, but later started another argument about God's righteous trial. Hearing this, Job confessed that the only one who could help him regain his honor was God. The only one that Job could turn to at this point was God. Job confessed that God was his salvation and that God was the one who looked after him. Job had everlasting faith in God even midst his deathly suffering. I am so excited that you have in your hands now and on your phones the Tong Doc Bible app. And let me tell you why. Very few people, just a handful of people in the world understand the way Dr. Zhou does, the way that this is one story from Genesis to Revelation, one story. And what does it mean for us to daily live that story as our life story? And 
He has found a way to do this. We need daily marinating of our mind and the soaking of our spirit in, in the Word of God. And that's why a, a, a Tom Dot Bible is so important. The scriptures, the story, Genesis to Revelation, is the daily mouth-to-mouth -mouth breathings of the Spirit of God into humans to make us truly who God made us to be. And that's why this app is so important. This app shows you how to do mouth, that God, enables God to do mouth-to-mouth -mouth resuscitation on you every day of your life, 365 days a year. I'm so glad you have it. You will feel that healing that comes from mouth-to-mouth -mouth breathings of the Spirit on you as you use this app.